occupied the first two spots and both men are back here challenging for what would be a remarkable middle distance double. Jensen Johnson, he was the silver medalist the other night. The official just checking the toes are behind the line. Three and three quarter laps to the track. Well, perhaps the greatest threat here to an Indian double again is the fact that they're competing, both Manjit Singh and also Jensen Johnson, for the fourth straight evening. Two heats of the 800, a heat of the 1500, and now a final. And it is Al Manfaj wearing 905, one of the outsiders who's gone straight to the front. Johnson there in second place. Muradi, the Iranian there in third, and in fourth place, look out for him, Tiu Ali. At the moment, Rob, it's a very modest pace indeed. It's waiting for someone to take this race by the scruff of the neck. It is, and I wonder if it continues like this. It may begin to play into the hands of the fast finishers, but Jensen Johnson playing a good tactical game at the moment. Tiu Ali looks well poised up on the shoulder of the Iranian, who was only just off the podium in the 800 metres. 697, Musab Ali, the Asian under 20 steeplechase and 5,000 metre champion, right at the back of the field and now beginning to lope his way through the other back markers. But he's doing a good job. Now he's just beginning to wind up the pace a little bit, the Iraqi, but they're not interested in going with him, Martin. The big men are all queuing up behind, waiting for someone to make a really definitive move, which they still haven't done. Well, they're almost through halfway in this 1500 meter final. It's still Montfarge out in front. In second place is Johnson. Then comes the very, very dangerous Tuali, who has run 334, which is world class, although that was six years ago. The Chinese starting to make a bit of a move. Luo coming around right the outside. And at the moment, the 800 meters champion, Manjit Singh, only has two men beside him. So the penultimate lap. They're running three or four wide, which goes to show there's no pace on this race at the moment. But each one of these men making sure that they're in a position to cover the move if and when it comes. 138. Wait for him to take off. He's itching to go. Is Tuali. He strutted off the track after winning his heat. He had the air of a confident man. He may well be the man there. 138 to make the move. But look at Johnson. Look also at Maradi, just waiting to cover any moves that come. Manjit Singh, four from the black, wearing the blue vest there of India. He's got a tremendous kick finish. We saw that in the 800. It looks like he's adopting similar tactics here. This time they'll hear the bell, and it is Tuali who moves to the front for the first time. Look though at Johnson, the Indian record holder, there in third place. As it has been throughout, it is Al Omfouage who leads. To Ali there in second place. No sign yet of Triuch. He's well back. But it is Al Monfarge. Now the kick starting to come from To Ali. Here goes Maradi, who just missed out on the medal, trying to get there on the inside of Tuali, but Tuali knocks him back. No sign at the moment of the 800 metres champion. He's back there in about sixth or seventh spot, but he will finish very strongly. But it's going to be Jensen Johnson. A silver medalist into the 800, who hits the front first. And Johnson kicks. Fifth place in the Commonwealth Games. A silver medalist here in the 800, but now he's not to be denied. Manjit Singh is finishing very fast, but he's left it far too late. Johnson takes it. A tremendous performance. Muradi, fourth in the 800, comes through with a medal this time. But that was almost simple. He got it wrong two nights ago, but this was a performance without blemish. India win the 800, they win the 1500, they dominate the middle distances in Asia. A brilliant piece of acceleration there from Jinson Johnson. When he went to the front, it was absolutely definitive. Maradi has, had used his elbows quite a bit in that race. You can see the tension rising in the face of Tiu Ali, who was trying to hang on. Maradi was trying to force a gap on the inside down the back straight that wasn't there. He tried to force a gap round the top of the bend that wasn't there. In the end, it made no difference to Jinson Johnson.
The 800 meter silver medalist is the 1500 meter champion, and he did that in style. Here he wins his first major title. Maradi comes through with the silver. To Ali, who threatened so much there in third. Manjit seeing another fast finish from him. But in the end, I think the fourth race was a bit too much. And Hamza Driuch, well, the days are long gone when he was running 333 as a junior. He has, of course, been away from the sport as a consequence of a doping ban. It really has been a sparkling set of performances from the Indian men and women. Yet another gold medal for them with Jinson Johnson who was really class with the manner in which he accelerated away from Maradi and all the rest. A very, very composed piece of acceleration at the end of what's been a, a tough week for these guys. Bear in mind, this championship has been, in athletics term, conducted over six days. You'd expect a Worlds to be nine. So they've had a lot of racing to do in a short period of time. Jensen Johnson excellent value for this major title and he will relish